Hello everyone, my name is Peter Vorvis. I am the sales manager for Linear and Automation at NTN Canada, and I'm pleased to present to you a brief introduction of the NTN Linear Guide Online Configurator. This is a fast and efficient online tool for selecting linear guide systems. This is a very easy to use tool for identifying competitive products, calculating gross prices, and to generate the recommended NTN SNR part numbers. It can be used online without registration through the NTN SNR website. There are actually 30 brands programmed into this tool to interchange. And the product configurator provides a very simple and detailed description of all available options. And finally, there are 20 languages to choose from tailored for your preference. The tool can be found on our website by clicking Online Tools at the top, and then simply select the Linear Guide Online Configurator. After the program has started, you have the following options. Setting of language and currency at the top right-hand corner. Control to different links located at the top menu. Interchange of competitive products on the right side, and configuring an NTN SNR linear guide on the left. Let's start with the interchange of competitive products using a step by step approach. For the purposes of this demonstration, we will interchange part number GX25A2SS plus 1000 LK from manufacturer ABC as shown at the top. First of all, select the brand ABC. Once again, please note that there are more than 30 brands to choose from. Secondly, select the series to be interchanged. In this case, select the series prefix GX. Lastly, select 25 as the size to be interchanged and then hit the continue button. Here you will receive an overview of all possible candidates. Once the correct product has been identified that corresponds to the basic type GX25A, select the corresponding details tab on the very right side. This will then generate a detailed comparison table of the competitor's brand against all possible candidates. Any noted differences will be highlighted in yellow for review. You will also see that there are colored dots in the status column, which indicates the interchangeability. A green dot, as illustrated in these examples, means it is interchangeable according to DIN or ISO. A yellow dot means that the product is conditionally interchangeable and will have to be checked according to the highlighted differences in the table. And finally, if you receive a red dot, that means there are no alternative products available at this time. Once the correct product has been determined, hit the select button and you will begin to receive all details of the configuration. In the detailed configuration, all other options such as seals, preload, rail arrangement, precision class, and much more can be selected. This is one approach to interchanging a competitor's product. As a second approach, instead of entering the brand, series, and size, simply entering the type code of a competitor's product directly, even if the brand is unknown, is a much more convenient way to find the right alternative product. In this example, enter the existing part number and click Continue. Entering the entire type code provides much more information about the product and as a result, trims down the number of available selections. Once again, all parameters can now be compared by clicking the details button on the very right side, which will generate a table. After reviewing the table, the part number shown at the bottom was the closest match and was therefore chosen by clicking on 
the corresponding select button. This now takes you to the page for the detailed configuration. If further changes are required, these can be initiated on the left-hand side of this page. Please note that there are additional selections as you scroll down the left-hand side of this page. If the interchange is considered complete, the right-hand side lists and details which options have been recognized in the competitor's type code, as shown in the close-up. Below this analysis are the determined part numbers for the rail, carriages, and complete system, if applicable. If you click on any one of the downward arrows beside one of the part numbers, you will see a full description of the features. A copy of that description can also be downloaded in PDF form. At the same time, the gross price and the expected delivery time are displayed in the footers. If you know your purchase discount, it can be entered to reveal the corresponding net price. If no discount is known, the net price for the selected product can be requested by email by clicking on Send Inquiry. Now let's move on to configuration of an existing NTN SNR linear guide. This is entered on the left-hand side of the program. You can choose either the configuration of a rail, a carriage, or a completely assembled linear guide system. In our example, we will click on the largest tab labeled as Assembled System. You will be guided step-by-step -step through the selection of the options, which will be demonstrated in the following pages. Clicking on the Assembled System tab takes you to the Configurator function. The existing presets of each feature can be changed within the scope of the product range. To begin with, the series is selected, and in this case, LGB Standard Guide. Then, configuration of the rail is selected in several parts. First, the rail version. We will select the narrow version rail, which is suitable for standard linear guide carriages. Then the size is selected, and in this example, we have changed the selection from size 20 to size 25. When you make any changes to each of these entries, you will notice that the part numbers with their respective product descriptions on the right-hand side will automatically be updated. Next, the type of fastening system of the rail is reviewed. In our example, the rail with the through-hole design, type L, was selected. Now here's a good tip. To obtain further information on any selected option, click on the eye icon shown here in the upper left-hand corner. This handy feature will provide a direct link to the product catalog. Then the required rail length can be entered. In this example, we change the preset 1000 millimeter length to 400 millimeters. Then the precision class is selected. In this example, we will leave it at the standard normal precision level. Next, the rail arrangement can be specified below. This is more important when considering high precision classes. For normal precision cases, it can stay at one. There are a few more options for the rail. The rail segmentation is selected below. In the case of short rails, it is usually the same as the preset one piece or one segment rail. The G1 value is the position of the first hole from one end of the rail. It is preset with a standard dimension for each rail length. However, it can be changed as required. If necessary, a coding of the rail can also be selected as shown. As a last option, 
a special version of the rail can be specified based on a supplied drawing. This now completes the configuration of the rail. Let's now move on to the configuration of the carriage. To begin with, the version of the carriage is specified. In this example, we have selected Type X for the conventional carriage without ball chain. Note the highlighted blue box around our selection. Then one of the available heights can be selected. In the example, the standard normal height, H, will remain. You will notice that the carriage size was automatically set according to the earlier chosen size of the rail. In other words, the size for the carriage and the rail must match. Then you can choose between block and flange type carriages. In this example, the block design will remain. Following that, the length of the carriage must be determined. In this example, we changed from the standard length carriage to the long carriage design designated by L. All other carriage options can now be selected. All items initially shown here are the preset selections. They are as follows. SS seals for standard seals. The precision class, which was automatically matched to the selected precision class of the rail. Light preload designated by Z1. Greasing of the carriages with the standard SNR lube heavy duty. The selection and position of the lubrication connection. Choice of a carriage coating. And lastly, additional special requirements can be requested based on a supplied drawing. Finally, the system needs to be specified with the number of carriages for each rail. Similarly, with the interchange section of the program, the part numbers for the rail, carriage, and the complete system, along with the respective product description, are clearly illustrated. In addition, the gross price, applicable discounts, and the expected delivery time are displayed in the footers. This brings us to the end of the presentation. I would encourage everyone interested in learning more about this powerful tool by simply logging into our website and playing around with the configurator. With some practice, you will quickly learn how to navigate through the program. For further information, or if you have any questions or comments, please do not hesitate to post under this video or contact us at your local NTN branch. I sincerely wish to thank you very much for your attention.